Hello everyone, it's that college football guy here another video. As promised, the final preseason predictions video, the SEC. I'm gonna review the win-loss record I made for every I made predictions for every team in the SEC. Win-loss record. We're gonna see how well I did. And after that, we can hear the piece of paper. Is the win-loss record for every single conference I made prediction predictions for in the preseason? My final win-loss record and my Final winning percentage. I shot for at the beginning of the year. If you pay attention to the videos, I wanted 66.7%. Can I get two-thirds right? That's what I was shooting for my first year. Can I get two-thirds of the games right from the preseason? Considering all the crazy ups and downs, that's actually, I thought, would be pretty good standard. Considering the fact there's some guys I've seen that couldn't even crack 50%. Yeesh. But anyway... First and foremost, let's get the housekeeping out of the way. Everyone, please smash that like button. It helps with the algorithm and the analytics. Helps the video be seen by more people. Comment on the video. Love interacting with everybody. Tell me what you think about how badly I screwed up or how good of a job I did. And subscribe to the channel. We're on our way to 300 subscribers. And if you're a subscriber, you're going to subscribe. Make sure you hit that notifications bell so that way you don't miss a video. When I try to put, I'll try to put one out every single day. Sometimes sickness or issues say otherwise, but I try to do one every single day. All right. Basically, you're, if you watched the videos, or if you hadn't, I made the predictions for every single team, all the 14 teams in the SEC, and basically predicted their win-loss record for their entire schedule. If I go through a schedule here and say, like, um, Missouri beat Arkansas, lost to Georgia, beat Tennessee, or beat, beat Tennessee, they, okay, but say, like, Missouri beat, you know, the first two, like, you, you beat Arkansas, you lost to Georgia. Those are actually happening. If I say you beat Tennessee, you lost. That means I got the game wrong. So, let's start off with the first team. We're going to go SEC East first. We're going to go with Florida. I had them in the preseason go 8-4. and four. They went 6-6. Six and six. I had them beating Utah. Yes, I did predict them beating Utah. I had them beating Kentucky. They lost. I had them beating USF, losing to Tennessee, beating Eastern Washington and Missouri. Had them beating LSU. They lost. I had them losing to Georgia. I had them losing to Texas A&M. They won. Still don't know how they pulled that one off. Had them losing to South Carolina. They won. I had them beating Vanderbilt. They lost. And I had them beating Florida State. They lost. So 6-6 six and six, Florida. Georgia. I had them going 11-1. and one. They went 12-0. I had them beating Oregon, Samford, South Carolina, Kent State, Missouri, Auburn, Vanderbilt, Florida, Tennessee, Mississippi State. I had them losing in overtime to Kentucky. They won that game. And I had them beating Georgia Tech. So I went 11-1 and one for the prediction. By the way, Florida's 6-6 six six predicting Florida's record. 11-1 and one for Georgia. Kentucky. I had them beating Miami of Ohio. Actually, excuse me. I had them going 8-4 and four in the preseason. They went 7-5. and five. Had them beating Miami of Ohio. I had them losing to Florida. They won. I had them beating Youngstown State, Northern Illinois. Had them losing to Ole Miss. I had them beating South Carolina. They lost. I had him beating Mississippi State. I had him losing to Tennessee. I had him losing to Missouri. They won. I had him beating Vanderbilt. They lost. I had him beating Georgia. They lost. Just mentioned that in the previous video. And I had him beating Louisville. So they went seven and five in their prediction. I went seven and five in predicting Kentucky. Now Missouri. I had him going six and six. They went six and six. Uh, I had him beating Louisiana Tech. I had him beating Kansas State. They lost. I had him beating Abilene Christian. I had him losing to Auburn, Georgia, and Florida. I had him beating Vanderbilt. I had him losing to South Carolina. They won. I had him beating Kentucky. They lost. I had him losing to Tennessee. I had him beating New Mexico State. And I had him losing to Arkansas. They won. So I went 8-4 and four predicting Missouri's record. South Carolina. I had him going 6-6. Six and six. They went 8-4. and four. I had him beating Georgia State. I had him losing to Arkansas and Georgia. I had him beating Charlotte and South Carolina State. I had him losing to Kentucky. They won. Had him losing to Texas A&M. They won. Texas A&M. You know, I'll get into them later. Had him beating Missouri. They lost. I had him beating Vanderbilt. I had him beating Florida. They lost. I had him losing to Tennessee and Clemson. They won both. So I went 6-6 six and six predicting South Carolina. Now they came on strong at the end, didn't they? Tennessee. I had him going 9-3 and three in the preseason. They went 9-3. and three. I had him beating Ball State, Pitt, Akron, Florida. I had him losing to LSU. They won. I had him losing to Alabama. They won. I'm happy I got that one wrong. I had him beating UT Martin in Kentucky. I had him losing to Georgia. I had him beating Missouri. 
I had them beating South Carolina. They lost. I had them beating Vanderbilt. So they went 9-3 and three in their preseason. I went 9-3 and three in the predictions for Tennessee's record. Vanderbilt. I had them going 3-9. and nine. They went 5-7. and seven. I had them beating Hawaii and Elon. Not Elon Musk. Elon University. Uh, I had them losing to Wake Forest, beating Northern Illinois, losing to Alabama, Ole Miss, losing to Alabama, Ole Miss, Georgia, Missouri, and South Carolina. I had them losing to Kentucky. They won. I had them losing to Florida. They won. And I had them losing to Tennessee. So I went 10-2 and two predicting Vanderbilt's schedule. All right. SEC West time. Alabama. I had them going 11-1. and one. They went 10-2. and two. I had them beating Utah State, Texas, Louisiana Monroe, Vanderbilt, Arkansas, and Texas A&M. I had them beating Tennessee. They lost. I had them beating Mississippi State. I had them beating LSU. They lost. I had them losing to Ole Miss. They won. I had them beating Austin P and Auburn. So they went 9-3 and three in predictions for that record. Now we got Arkansas. I had them going 8-4. and four. They went 6-6. Six and six. I had them beating Cincinnati and South Carolina, along with Missouri State. I had them losing to Texas A&M and Alabama and Mississippi State. I had them losing to BYU. They won. I figured at BYU, they, the travel time, but they actually did pretty good. I had them beating Auburn. I had them beating Liberty. They lost. Still don't know how they lost that one. Had them beating LSU. They lost. I had them beating Ole Miss. I had them beating Missouri. They lost. So they went 8-4. and four. Against my record. 8-4 and four for prediction record there. Now it's time for Auburn. I had them going 6-6. Six and six. They went 5-7. and seven. I had them beating Mercer and San Jose State. I had them beating Penn State. They lost. Had them beating Missouri. Losing to LSU, Georgia, Ole Miss, Arkansas, and Mississippi State. I had them beating Texas A&M and Western Kentucky. And I had them losing to Alabama. So I went 11-1 and one predicting Auburn's schedule. All right, LSU. I had them going 8-4. and four. They went 9-3. and three. I had them beating Florida State. They lost. I had them beating Southern, Mississippi State, Mexico, and Auburn. I had them beating Tennessee. They lost. Had them losing to Florida. They won. Had them beating Ole Miss. Had them losing to Alabama. They won. Had them losing to Arkansas. They won. Had them beating UAB. And had them losing to Texas A&M. So I went 7-5 and five predicting LSU's schedule. It's the paper one so far off. Mississippi State. I had them going 7-5. and five. They went 8-4. and four. I had them beating Memphis and Arizona. I had them losing to LSU. I had them beating Bowling Green, Texas A&M, and Arkansas. I had them losing to Kentucky and Alabama. I had them beating Auburn. I had them losing to Georgia. I had them beating East Tennessee State. Perfect. I had them losing to Ole Miss. They won. 11-1 predicting Mississippi State. They had to screw it up at the end. Ole Miss. I had them going 8-4. and four. They went 8-4. and four. I had them picking Troy, beating Troy, Central Arkansas, Georgia Tech, Tulsa, Kentucky, and Vanderbilt. Had them losing to Auburn. They won. Had them losing to LSU. Had them losing to Texas A&M. They won. Had them beating Alabama. They lost. Had them losing to Arkansas. Had them beating Mississippi State. They lost. So I went 8-4 and four predicting Ole Miss's record. And Texas A&M. I had them going 9-3. and three. They went 5-7. and seven. All right. I had them beating Sam Houston. I had them beating Appalachian State. Choke job loss. Had them beating Miami Arkansas. I had them losing to Mississippi State and Alabama. I had them beating South Carolina. They lost. I had them beating Ole Miss. They lost. I had them beating Florida. They lost. I had them losing to Auburn, beating UMass, and beating LSU. So I went 8-4 and four predicting Texas A&M. So Make sure I got this right here. Yep. So here's the records for what I did. I did six and six, eleven and one, seven and five, eight and four, six and six, nine and three, ten and two, nine and three, eight and four, eleven and one, seven and five, eleven and one, eight and four, eight and four. Hundred and sixty eight games. A hundred and nineteen and forty nine. Seventy point eight percent winning percentage. Nice. So I got that one right. Hold on here, let me uh, take a hit of the sprite. I've been drinking 
ginger ale, water, and Sprite in order to clear all this stuff out of my system. Now the final, the final one. For the American, I was 97 and 35. For the Mountain West, I was 105 and 39. For the Sun Belt, I was 109 and 57. For the ACC, it was 105 and 60. The Big Ten, I was 112 and 56. Big Ten, it was 112 and 56. The Big 12, 65 and 55. Horrible. The Pac-12, 103 and 41. The SEC, 119 and 49. For a final record of 815 wins of 392 losses, 1,207 games, a 67.5% winning percentage. I barely got it. Huh. So, I got my goal. Barely. But uh, tell me what you think down in the comments. Um, let me know what you think about this. About my preseason predictions and what I did for the SEC and for overall how I did. If you think I did a good job or not, let me know down in the comments down below. So, thanks everybody for watching this video. As always, please like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks everybody for watching it. If anything breaks off, I'll be doing anything else. I got a little bit of cleaning to do here because I'm going to be home for a week. So I thought I'd jump on that right after I get done with this video. But anything breaks in college football, coaching-wise or serious news, I will let you know. Thanks, everybody, for watching this video. Be safe out there. Be warm out there because, dang, it's cold. And please, be good to each other.